What's going on, LFA TV? Major update coming to you guys live. And it's gonna get very, very exciting. <laughs> I feel like I say exciting every single video, but it is exciting every video. So for those of you that are subscribers, you guys are along. So uh, major key alert. Check out all these parts right here. You guys thought Mr. Gallardo was playing, huh? This stuff is no joke. Master mechanic over there hard at work. Now let me talk about some of the parts that you got here. As uh, you guys do remember, he is doing a 1JZ swap on the 300ZX. So these are the major parts that he was waiting on. Um, so uh, let me see, where do I start? Down here we got a six puck. Shh. Down here we got a six puck clutch. Um, for those of you that are not aware he's going he's going to be using a w58 uh transmission and uh you know some of you guys may say well why not a cd09 or a r154 the crazy thing is that mr gallardo has a lot has had a lot of success with the w58 transmission and on top of that it's not going to be crazy power going through the tranny so the w58 is going to hold pretty well got a brand new uh pressure plate new six puck clutch uh new flywheel he got a boost gauge, a couple of boost gauges one of them is for the supra the other one's for the 300 zx we got a we got a tile type of uh blow off valve right here yeah boy these are the same ones that we are using on the supra so um we went and he went ahead and bought another one of those now up here what we got is a and a, a bell housing. This is a, a Jay-Z uh, bell housing to a W58. Right here we got a pretty cool drive shaft. These are from the boys over at uh, the drive shaft shop. I'm sure you guys have heard of their name. They're very well known. And check this out, like, I'm, I'm literally lifting it up with one hand. It's aluminum, it's pretty darn light. It's pretty crazy. Um, let's see up here. We got a very, very nice downpipe. This is from uh, Future Fabrications. This was uh, custom made for his specific swap. So uh, they do some nice work. Got some really clean welds on here. Um, you know, Curly Fab was real busy at the time. So he had to do something else. Up here we got a uh, the intercooler. This is a four inch core, so four inches wide is pretty big. That's what she said, right? <laughs> Anyways, um, it's a very nice looking intercooler, even though it's pretty small actually. So it's gonna look very nice in there. Up here we got the motor mounts for the One JZ, which I believe these are stock. Uh, are these stock? Yeah. Uh, yeah. So these are pretty much uh, stock motor mounts. They were only modified up here. So they're made for the 1JZ swap. The other crazy thing that he had noticed is that he had never seen this pickup tube right here for the oil pump, which is pretty crazy. I don't know if you guys are familiar, but the ones in the 7M and then the two jz's and one jz's they look a lot different so this pickup tube right here it's pretty crazy he had never seen it i had never seen it now over here moving to the sump oil pan as you can see it's pretty much a stock um oil pan it's only been modified so so that's pretty cool and oh i forgot down here we got a, a griffin radiator i actually didn't know that these were discontinued but 
I guess he bought a used one. Curly Fab in the building with the fresh cut. What's up, bro? What's up? Mr. Gallardo wants to know why why you didn't hook him up with the downpipe, man. You don't make those things, man. You don't make them? I'm taking that as part of cool. Curly Fab said, Curly Fab said he, he does way better work than that. So over here, Mr. Gallardo's hard at work, changing everything that needs to be changed. What are you doing right now? I'm doing the valve cover? The, all the gaskets? I believe he's gonna believe. I believe he's gonna begin to take off the transmission and prep everything. Cause this thing's gonna be in there within like five minutes. What's up LFA TV? Thanks for tuning in as always. It's literally the next day and uh, I'm not kidding whenever I say Mr. Gallardo always works fast because look, we said we needed an engine hoist. The engine is pretty much on the floor, ready to go. So uh, I, I think it's gonna get dropped in today. So uh, let's get to it. So uh, the oil pan is uh, supposed to do on this case, since it's cut, it's going to sit between the subframe and the sway bar. So you can see this right there. So people that do these swaps usually have to cut that anyways, so it can sit kind of flush right there. So that's basically where it's going to be. All right, this is the old pickup tube. It's the new pickup tube that I was talking about. Comment down below and if any of you guys could guess what this pickup tube came off of, I would give you guys my Supra. <laughs> How about that? Watch the, somebody knows and you have to give it up. <laughs> Every time. 